Okay, we're joined with by Ben Ainsley and Russell Coots. Ben, three-time Olympic gold medalist. Uh, Russell, one-time Olympic gold medalist. People forget that, Russell, don't they? And four-time, <laughs> four-time America's Cup winner, of course. And guys, why are we all together here at the Festival Hall in London? Ben. Oh, we're here. Two reasons. Uh, firstly, to announce uh, BAR, which is a new uh, team for the America's Cup World Series. And also, you know, my involvement to join Oracle Racing for the, for the defence of the America's Cup. So, uh, very exciting announcements on both counts. The world of uh, yachting must be absolutely shaking because we've got Mr. America's Cup and we've got Mr. Olympics together, Russell. That, that's a pretty awesome duo. Well, I think there's a lot, lot of challenge in, in, in our team with the events, obviously. Huge talent that we're bringing into our team, and you know, I think that's going to help help our team enormously. I think it's great for Ben for, for developing his future you know, ambitions to, to, to create his team, and it's also great for the Americans. Cup. Now, without embarrassing each other, uh, Ben, obviously best known in this country for all your amazing Olympic feats, but. Uh, I'd actually like to say a few words about the, the fellow next to you because America's Cup is, is in your blood, isn't it, as well? Yeah, for all say it's the America's Cup is a, is, a, is a pinnacle, really. It's a huge uh, target. Russell's obviously the most successful America's Cup sailor ever. His face is going a bit bigger and bigger as we talk about. <laughs> um, no, I have got a huge amount of respect for Russell, but also for everyone in the Oracle team, you know, guys like Jimmy Smith or Tom Stecky, you know, this goes on. And, as Russell said, they've got a fantastic team, so for me it's really an honour to be a part of that and a great opportunity to work with Russell, who's uh, Mr. America's Cup, really. And Mr. America's Cup. Um, you have won an Olympic gold medal a few years ago now. Uh, perhaps a few words about, about this fella. Four Olympics, one silver, three golds, consecutive over 16 years. He's going for hopefully number four in London. He's, uh, he's not too shabby, is he, as a sailor? Fantastic. No, no he, he, I mean, hopefully he's, he, he won again this year and, and, and become the most successful Olympic athlete in sailing ever, you know, which is, I mean, that's a fantastic achievement on its own. And, and you know, one of the great things about Ben is I know that he loves to win, uh, probably at least as much as I do, <laughs> and as, as much as Jimmy Spittle does and, and the other guys do as well. And, and that's, uh, I think that's a fantastic uh, trait to have, you know. It'll be a great asset for us. Now, for the uninitiated, just because Ben's won that hall of medals at the Olympics doesn't automatically mean he'll be a great America's Cup sailor, does it? But funnily enough, he probably will be. Well, I think, I think in, this, in actual fact, as it's turned out, and this is sort of a, a bit of a discovery um, for a lot of us, I think this new format is, is, is probably better suited to people that are good small boat sailors. They, they, when you sail these boats, you, they feel more like a small boat, and, and particularly with the wing development and so forth. Um, you know, I think they're, they're, they're frankly more athletic, it's a more balanced skill set that you need um, to sail them. And so I think you know, guys like Ben are going to come in and you know, dominate in the future. Now, but just perhaps you'd like to explain, um, uh, we're not actually going for the 2013 America's Cup uh, for Ben Ainsley Racing, that's a little bit too short notices, even yeah. for you, yeah. uh, but long term, uh, hopefully the next one after that, and this is all sort of, I guess, preparing, practicing, yeah. getting in there, ready for a proper push for British America's Cup Challenge. Yeah. Well, you're right, I mean, it's just not realistic to, to be you know, trying to put a team together at this time for the 2013 America's Cup, so we hope that through the America's Cup World Series we can get the experience, get the uh, team a brand, bring in the right partners who are looking to the future for the long term for the team to be a, a successful challenger in the, in the future. But it's a lot to learn. It's a fantastic opportunity for me to learn with Oracle Racing and you know, hopefully build BAR up into something that's going to be successful in the future. I think there are, I mean, you may disagree with me, but um, similar to uh, look at cycling and how in, in Britain, you know, it's always been about track cycling. It's taken someone like Mark Cavendish to come along and really introduce people to, to what the aficionados are into, which is the Tour de France. I think there's a similar thing here with sailing. I mean, Ben, you're so well known for your Olympic feats, but the sailor is, is, is into the America's Cup, perhaps even more. Yeah, that's right. And, you know, you talk maybe better than me about the, the changes that have gone on in the America's Cup, but it's now much more dynamic, much more athletic. The races are shorter, the whole TV package, the effort that's gone into that production is huge. 
we're seeing a much tidier, uh, more attractive package to a younger audience now, and I think that's the future of the America's Cup. And, you know, it's really exciting and, and certainly uh, for us, great to be a part of it. Now, sport, as you know, is uh, forever comes up with great stories. Now, the great sailing scriptwriter in the sky, right now, is just penning his... Uh, his put it together his thoughts and we'll pen this story that you'll, you're going to help him, he's going to help you and in years to come he'll beat you at the America's Cup. <laughs> That's a possibility. Absolutely. But, you know, as I said, I'm worried about winning this one. Yeah. One step at a time and, 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 and uh, you know, Ben's going to help us do that. I guess it's probably better racing with him than racing against him. Absolutely. I've seen it. So I'd much rather race with him than, than against him. And who's got more to learn here? I guess it's probably you then, isn't it? Oh, undoubtedly, yeah. I mean, uh, Russell's got a huge amount of experience in the cup and uh, he's a proven winner in this game. And so for me, to be able to be, you know, not just for Russell, but the rest of the guys in the team and all the, the designers as well, it's an incredibly strong team. So uh, for me, it's a great opportunity. Fantastic. So, 2012 Olympics, 2013 um, preliminaries for America's Cup, 2015? Proper go at it? Yeah, let's hope so. I mean, that's the that's the long term plan, and you know, it's a big challenge, it's a big ask, but uh, you know, we've got the right people involved, the right opportunity now. And, uh, it's really a case of making it happen. Fantastic. Well, good luck, guys. Thank well, you. Thanks for catching up with us. Thanks. Thanks. Cheers.